Alright, welcome to part 5 of didn't expect to do this longer than I needed to. It really makes you, like, wonder when you, you when things go off the rail and you didn't expect something to happen. Then again, like, so much unexpected stuff has happened to me. And solely because I'm playing solo, playing normal, and I have absolutely no help at all because I have no animals of any kind to ally me in these situations. Alright, there's the torch. Alright, there we go. I'm back in the right direction. It's what I mean when I said I should not put these things on a wall. Don't know if I should go down there just solely to get that one magma block that, has, that drawn me here earlier ago. I like earlier ago, I said quite a while back. Yeah, that's the more appropriate thing to say. I gotta go to the forest of the multicolored trees. Because I was able to find so many trees that have different variety as opposed to just pine. What's that noise? Well, besides outside. That is a motorcycle, which does not exist in this game unless you mod it. Which I don't think is a possibility with, this, with the uh, mobile version. Okay, I should be getting closer and closer to my home. Alright, there we go. We've made it. So in the end, that whole thing was worth diddly squat. In the end, I almost got myself killed on several occasions. I did brought back some mementos, and I mean that, I mean just snow in general. I'm gonna go check out that village. Wait a tick. Is that a different village compared to the one I was near? I could find something interesting in there. There could be a saddle, but then again, do saddles spawn in villages? Oh wait, I think I can get a beehive and just protect myself with bees. Then again, bees aren't really that aggressive. This village is entirely different from the one I was at, actually. Hmm, pretty neat. I'm gonna do what every other person does and scatter. The fuck is this? Oh, hello there. Oh, you're a cleric? Too bad I don't have any emeralds. Bye. Oh, there's even a cat here. Oh, that's that's nice. Where's your shit? Hey, how's it going? Oh, I got nothing to say. Hey, what's up? Looking <laughs> cat. I could live near a village just to keep myself safe. Then again, my house alone is not good enough. Oh, there's mine stuff here. Alright, head back to home. Nothing really to grab myself of any information. We're coming back with iron horse armor, but yet I don't have a saddle to work with. Kind of destroys the purpose of doing it. I could try to make myself a little bit better by making a fishing rod. They have a lot of web on me and a lot of sticks. Can you fish up a saddle? Eh, that's probably not in the cards of such things. Besides, the, the reason why I'm making this last part is to specifically get back to my house so I can end the episode rather than continuously play my Minecraft that I already have. It's supposed to be Minecraft and Morrowind, but now it's just Minecraft for today. Well, tonight. It's tonight. I usually record these at night. Well, it'll be today, wherever you're watching at. Or probably somewhere across the world. I gotta stop trying to investigate more of these areas. Because most of them might lead me to death. Chicken with every chicken. Alright, I've reached home. I'm going inside first to 
to empty out all my supplies and then afterwards I'll end the episode. We won't have to like be picky on horses because there's horses literally everywhere and will spawn in every now and then. Don't be tempted by holes in your freaking yard just to get home. I think I saw a zombie in like a little like little water area here and then it turned instantly instantly, instantly into a freaking uh to a, um, a drown in seconds, and I was like, oh, well, that's no fun. Oh, speak of the devil, look at that, a drowned. I guess a zombie just died here from my magma blocks. I mean, it's at least some of a good investment. Alright, I'm gonna go put this bed on the other side house. There we go. That way I know which way bed to take. Oh wait, no, I'm supposed to empty up my supplies first. Don't need a sign. Don't need this dirt anymore. The logs here for now. I forgot you can just hold shift and put everything inside. Alright, I'm going to turn most of this slime into reeds. Oh, I can only make four. Wait, I need to have more. That's it for this episode. This has been a, quite a journey indeed, to say the least. I put those. Oh, wait, no, never mind. No, wait, right now, so I'm straight. But yeah, th that was an experience. I lost a lot of stuff, gained a lot of stuff, and lost a lot of stuff. Mostly lost a lot of stuff. But regardless, that's it for this episode. I'm it's surprised I actually made this a five parter rather than two parter. But in any cases, I'll see you all in the next episode. Wait, hold on, let's get servers. Am I still connected to other servers in this? I mean, it is Bedrock, but again, most of the servers I usually play were in Java. Did I reload the world? Done. Yeah, I actually reloaded by accident. I didn't know where the mouse was, so I hope I didn't press the lead. I don't know, it's like a single option or anything. Where am I? Dang it, where's the mouse? It's hard to find that thing sometimes. There we go, I'm just gonna use touch control, I mean keyboard controls to find my way out. Wait, how do you shift the, oh there we go. Oh wait, these are just like regular servers and stuff. Not something that I'm familiar with. They're mostly part of the realms. But yeah, that's it for this episode. I'll see you all in the next one. Bye!